Just tied a rope around a tree, bowline knot. It's holding tight. I'm at Toby Run, or Tobe Run, not sure. We'll go with Tobe Run. It's down below me. I hopped over a guard rail right near Holtwood Dam. Apparently, there's a lair down here. This might be a short and sweet video, but I'm gonna kind of back down this uh, hill here and see what we can find. Uh, from what I've seen on Uncharted Lancaster and through uh, Brett from Topo Ranger, pretty cool place. I don't know if I'll need light down there. Definitely gonna wear a helmet because <laughs> I'm hanging on the cliff right now. Let's go. And here we are. Let's rip over here so I know where to go when I get out of here. But here we are, the lair at Toe Brun. Flowing a little bit here. There's supposed to be a waterfall inside. Hope there's enough flow so we can see it. All right, so going in here. Brought the headlamp. I got kind of a deep spot here. Trying not to get soaked, but if I do, so be it. Yeah, I was just uh, a lot of water there. Big log to walk on here. Skylight up here. Oh, it's such a cool air. Not sure who Tobe was, but he must have been an evil mastermind. Look at this place. Oh my goodness. This is incredible. Middle of the day here, but I'm uh, really glad I brought the headlamp and the helmet, honestly. Um, might go for some waterproof shoes or a um, you know, some boots next time. is amazing. I'm going to keep going towards the back here. It's probably about 30 feet deep maybe. So I'm going to head back this way. I hear the waterfall. God. I hope this is coming across the size of this place it's got to be 20 25 feet high ceiling open in places almost looks worn out by water flow like potholes or something Dang, this is crazy there's not much out there on this place uncharted lancaster has a little bit that they kind of did in conjunction with uh Topo Ranger. There, looking out the way I came in. And uh, 
I'll link to the video that Brett made with uh, Lewis. They came here to check it out. Uh, one or two other videos out there, but not much. Just a big, long kind of lift here. Ripped on and slipped here. That's about as far as I can go. That's where I came in. And I think it's about as far as I can go. There's a pool of water here from the falls. It's all about as far in as I can go. I don't know how good the lighting's going to be, but I'm trying to get over here to the waterfall. All right, so I hope this conveys exactly how uh, big this place is here. Um, you know, about 20 feet high, open ceilings in a lot of spots. I don't know what helps more here with this light on my head, but about 30 feet deep. The floor is all logs and uh, slippery rock and puddles, big uh, kind of little lakes. But, uh, yeah, definitely worth doing. There's a lot of drippage coming down. It's getting dripped all over my arm. But really cool. There's no real parking for it. When I get back, I'll kind of show you where I park. There's a concrete slab right before you get to the dam. And that's kind of where I went. So I don't know how long I should stay there, honestly. But I'd love to stay and check this out a little more. But I think this is just going to be a quick hitter video today. I'm going to go and try and get back up the uh, bank where I jumped over the guardrail. Toe run. This is awesome. The lair. If I ever have any evil plans, I'm coming here. Okay, so one last look at Tobe run coming out. You can see my green rope down here that I'll climb back up with. Um, so here's the entrance. Doesn't look like much, but I wasn't, uh, maybe I was ducking a little bit at the beginning, uh, but not too far in. Uh, that really opens up uh, vertically. So a lot of skylights and everything up there. And maybe someday if I have more time, come down, try and uh, get up on top of these rocks, maybe. But quick hitter, check out the lair and get out of here without being towed or getting a parking ticket or something like that, I think is my goal. Mission accomplished. Oh, wow. So. My God. Gigantic. Pole. Metal rusty poles wedged down in there. I bet that's got a story. There's another piece of metal over there. Maybe this was an evil lair. And actually, now that I'm looking... kind of a strap metal strap hmm. well there probably were some evil shenanigans that went down here at some point 
but uh, nothing right now. So my shenanigans is that uh, pole over there too. This one just goes under, it's buried under a tree and mud and everything else. So. All right, let's climb out of here. I definitely recommend the helmet. I bumped my head a couple times in the lair and I definitely recommend a rope. Pull yourself up this hill. All right, so here we are on, uh, uh, where's this old Hulkwood Road? <sighs> Two vehicles passed me when I was getting out of my car, so I'm hoping that if it was not legal for me to park there, somebody might have said something. All it is down here is like dam employees, the Hulkwood Dam, and there's a fishing platform out here. And my car's here. That's good. Car's here, no visible ticket. That's a success. Got back to the car with the rope, helmet, everything. Uh, glad I had that equipment. Uh, you're jumping over a guardrail and you're going straight down a bank uh, to approach Tow Brun. Totally worth it. The lair was awesome. I'm going to get out of here. What a, what a cool thing, man. Thanks for watching this quick video. Subscribe. Ring the bell. Watch some more videos. Coming up with some weird stuff now, but hopefully interesting. I'll see you next time out there. Thanks a lot.